Hey guys, it's me here. Um, so I just wanted to show you the, the Christmas briars that I got. Um, I thought I kept you guys waiting long enough. No, I did not get the one from my sister. But, well, I didn't get that one yet. I'll say that yet. But I'll show you the ones that I did get. I got two. And right now you're looking at the legs of one of them. I got Bayberry and Roses, who's really, really pretty. And the camera, he looks like a gray, but he's really like a purpley color. Let's try and see if I can get him in a spot. No, that's not gonna work. He looks like the Andalusian and the or the Lusitano in the in the camera, but he's not. Oh, not. He's got a really pretty blaze. And if this doesn't autofocus, I'm sorry. It's because I'm using my regular camera instead of my phone camera because my phone ran out of memory. But he is not LSQ, nor I don't think he'll ever will be. Plus, you can't really show the mold because of the shoulder detachment. But you can see one of his giant flaws right there, right here. I don't know how that got there, but that's one of his major flaws. Um, I thought he had a flaw in his offside. Yeah, he does. It's this little hoof rub right here, or this black mark on his hoof. You can't see it. There, you can kind of see that dark spot. But other than that, he's pretty. I won't put it, be putting his tack back on because it was really complicated to take off. In fact, I had to even take some of it apart. So, like, I had to cut some of it. Please don't say, oh my god, you ruined the costume. I didn't mean to ruin the costume. It's just it was very, very difficult to take off. So, don't judge me on that, please. So, yeah, but he's really pretty. Um, I think he's my third or fourth horse now on the Esprit mold. Because I have Esprit. I have Pecos. I have him. And I can't remember what other horses I have on the and on the Esprit mold. But yeah, he's nice. I, I, you know, oh yeah, now you can see him for kind of the color. He's like this color on his barrel. Um, but yeah, he's nice. Overall, he's nice. I don't know what I'm going to call him. His paint job is okay. You know, it's not perfect, but like right here is kind of weird. And I thought he had dappling, but apparently he doesn't. But his markings are crisp. I don't see any... Well, his... Okay, his marking is somewhat smudged. But on his face, it's really crisp. If you can see that. But I don't intend on showing him because of, you know, the Esprit uh, mold. Because um, of the shoulder detachment. And plus, he's got all these flaws. But if you want to see a picture of him with the tack on, here it is. He is Bayberry and Roses. But yeah, the tack is really pretty, I'm not going to lie. It was just very, very, very complicated to take off. So I had to kind of cut some of it on the legs. Um, but I'll still use it, like the top part, like the Roses part, like for other stuff. But yeah, that's him. He's really pretty. I think he's cute, you know. Even for an Esprit, he's really cute. So, yeah. Now, the next horse I was super, super happy to get. Um, I knew I was getting him because I paid for him. Um, he's on my favorite mold, which is the Smart Chicolina mold. He is a glossy variation of the one that I already have. And no, he's not a prize model. Before you guys go there, he's not a prize model. He is... I'm run of... 500 I think he is the glossy ginger horse he looks darker in the camera but he's really not that dark actually he appears a little well, yeah kind of darker and his dappling appears more in the camera than it does in real life but yeah here he is he is so pretty oh my gosh I love this guy I was so thrilled when I found out I could get him He's just a little dusty. But yeah, he's gonna go up there. Sorry, my room's a mess. He's gonna go up there next to my other ginger horse, my mat. He's going up there. 
Sorry, I'm just zooming out. But yeah, he's super, super pretty. I don't know what I'm going to call him yet, but I don't need any name suggestions. He's LSQ as far as I can see. I don't see any flaws on him. So yeah, I'll be definitely showing this guy. I'll definitely be showing him. So yeah, this is him. He's so pretty. Mwah. So yeah, th those are my horses. Um, he'll be shown as a quarter horse, as you guys obviously can guess. And here's the card that came with him. The American Quarter Horse card. So yeah, and um, Bayberry here came with a catalog. He came with this catalog, the horse scene catalog. The 2014, I think this is. The 2013 or 2014 catalog, I don't know. Got one other catalog of that, but can't get over how that I got this guy. But you can see he's really pretty dabbling. He's got it everywhere. But yeah, those are the horses that I got for Christmas. Oh, and on Bayberry's belly it says, um, Happy Holidays, Bri Briar 2014. So yeah, on his main job isn't really the best right along here as you, can, as you guys can see. So he'll just be a shelf model. Um, but yeah, those are the horses that I got for Christmas. Even though I paid for them, but that's okay. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing them. I don't have much time left. I've got only like three minutes left and I've been talking for seven minutes. So I hope you guys liked seeing them for the first time and have a wonderful day. So I guess I will talk to you guys later. Bye.